so you know I did say I was gonna pull a part two of what's in my diaper bag so make sure you like and subscribe if you have not already subscribe it should be gray not red because if it's red you're not subscribed you need to make sure that thing is gray and make sure you turn on the post notifications so you know when I post a video let's get into it so you know I bought a diaper bag and I started to put things in it and then I realized the diaper bag was not fitting everything and I wasn't even halfway done with halfway filling it up not full fully filling it up halfway of halfway you know for like three-fourths of it and I'm like um I'm gonna get a book bag so I was gonna go out and buy a book bag but I was like you know I actually have my Feli's book bag that I never used really I think I used it like once or twice and I was like you know what why am I buying a diaper bag girl my my daughter can use this it's fine you know no nah, it ain't it ain't no it ain't no gucci bag or nothing but you know she she good she good she got everything she needs so but let's get into what's in my diaper bag so i want to start off with i have these wet ones sensitive skin hands and face um wipes i got them for if i need to wipe my hands off or wipe her hands off don't want to use up all my baby wipes so i just was like you know maybe maybe just use these for just anything really so in the first pocket of the bag i have grip water which um this i actually like with my diaper bag as well I asked around with different moms so if I don't use some of this stuff it's cool but I want to make sure I have it you know um grip water and they said that it's really good for the baby to help with gas colic fuzziness and hiccups so yeah I got some grip water and I got some aquaphor I got some aquaphor I think I got um so I have my nipple butter for you know the nipples um I have my nipple butter and um this is made with organic plant-based so this is a uh, nursing care nipple butter soothes and relieves soreness um it's what I have and I put this in the description below I got some hand cream just in case you know, you know, cause, cause your hands are dry. You don't want to put your hand down. Sorry, you guys. You don't want to put your hand down and you got the crust, the crust in the line right there. You know, you don't want to have that. So what you gonna do, pop you some hand cream. And I have some petroleum jelly in here. Skin protectant. <laughs> you guys. I have a little travel size uh, Johnson head to toe wash and shampoo. And I have some bedtime lotion in here. And I have this little Tide uh, thing, like if you spill something on yourself, you're supposed to just wipe it and it clears it up. And yeah, that's what I have in there so far. You guys, if y'all think I'm overdoing it, just let me know. Or if you think I'm forgetting something, let me know. Because, like I said, I'm first time mommy here. And I want to do everything right. So, second, the second bag. I got this. It has the brush and all that stuff in there. I packed it just in case. Um, so, I have a little zipper in here. And in the zipper, I have some tissues. And I have her first aid kit in here. And that's what's in that little pocket there. Um, United Healthcare actually sent me the, um, the, um, 
the um what did I just say first aid kit they sent that to me in the mail shout out to y'all and then in here I have so I have um, um oh, two washcloths for her um I have a bib which you know I don't think she needs the bib right now but my friend said that they've used bibs before to for burp cloths just in case you don't sew. I just backed a bib. <laughs> um, I have two burp cloths in here. Two burp cloths in here. And two receiving blankets in here for her. So I actually have to pack, I forgot, a bigger blanket. Um a big blanket for her in here so I need to do that um book that is not want to cooperate with me right now all right and that's what's in this bag which I'm gonna probably so we get to the big bag in the back oh actually I already packed a blanket okay well this blanket could actually go in the front. So I have a blanket for her. Everything I've gotten in here, I've already washed. I've already washed the coat sheets and everything. Um, I used Pure X um, and some Drift little, um, they're kind of like the downy unstoppables, but they were just in a Drift thing. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know. But, uh, I have some fragrance free huggy wipes in here and I have some pampers sensitive skin baby wipes in here as well and then I have in here diapers this is all her little new newborn diapers in here newborn diapers in here some of this stuff you know like i said i'm a first time mom i don't really know what a baby needs a newborn needs i mean but i have it in here just in case you know so i in here is nothing but pacifiers which i'm probably she's probably not going to use that pacifier right now but a pacifier and a little teether but she's probably not going to need that right now but it's in there anyway never know so and then I have my, um, so these are some more nursing pads just in case I, you know, need them in here. So I have that in there. And then I have, um, some outfits in here for her in the back pocket. So I have, so I have her mittens, her little mittens right here. They're so tiny, you guys. Her little mittens, her socks, her socks are right there. So then I didn't know what or how long she's gonna be in there. So I packed this little, little. I guess it's a little sleeper, I think. A little sleeper for her. I've, like I said, I've already washed everything. Um. And I packed her. Somebody bought this for her. So there's a little onesie. It says hello. With the little warm pants. And it came with a jacket. Because she's going to be born, you know, winter time. Or close to winter. And I have this daddy's little... Daddy's little princess onesie for her. And my boyfriend picked this out. It says, the princess has arrived. So it's a little long sleeve with this little hat. Along with these little leggings. And yeah, so that's what I have in her diaper bag for the hospital. Um, I'm sure that once she gets older, I'm probably gonna need a lot more stuff in here. But this is only for, like I said, for the the hospital is what I've packed so far. 
So, yeah. And thank you guys for watching. And thank you guys for supporting me through this pregnancy, like I said before. And yeah, make sure you like and subscribe. Let me know what you packed, what you didn't pack, what you think I should pack before the hospital. Um, if I'm forgetting any, if you think I'm forgetting something or whatever else. And yeah, thank you. Bye. You got it, girl, you got it.